Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Tove Naturally and I'm back again with another video. So today I'll be doing a collab with a hair company called Betterland Hair. So they sent me this package right here. It's super duper cute. Like, look at that. So this company, it's basically a natural hair company and they have like natural hair clip-ins. It's for all black women. It says it right there, hair for black women. So no matter what texture your hair is, no matter your hair type, they have all hair types. And this is what the clip-in looks like. Me specifically, I got the 3C4A clip-in. And this is what it looks like. So um, this is basically my type of hair. My hair has no products in it right now, but whenever I put products in my hair, it looks kind of like this. So I'm going to blend it into my hair and I'm basically going to be doing a half up, half down, two buns and the back out. And I can't wait because I've never done that style before and I'm trying to look cute. So <laughs> I'm excited for this video. And they also sent me something that was like super duper cute. They sent me a little card. Oh, they also sent me in case like the clip-ins come off. I have extra ones and I have a thread. And they sent me this thing right here. And this card that says to dare to obey. This is super cute. And then it, it looks like this and a little note inside but yeah so basically with this hair you can shampoo it and put your like styling products in it before you put it into your hair but for me personally I wanted to style it while it's like in my hair so the only thing that I'll be doing I'll just be wetting it and put in my cream on it like the products that I'll be using today I'll be wetting it and put it on it but then I'm gonna clip it into my hair and like wet it again and like blend it into my hair the products that I'll be using is the curls blueberry brisk whipped curl cream the eco style olive oil gel of course water and then for the clip-ins there's two clip-ins with two clips two clip-ins with another two clip but these are a bit wider two clip-ins with three clips as you guys can see right there two clip-ins with four clips and two clip-ins with five clips so right here I'm just showing you guys how I separated my hair into different sections and I did this so that it would be easier to put the clip-ins into my hair so now I'm working on one section first. I'm wetting my hair with water and detangling my hair. I'm using the Curls Blueberry Brisk Whipped Cream, rubbing it into my hair as like a leave-in conditioner. And then I'm using my Denman brush and detangling my hair. So now I'm going ahead with the Eco Style Gel and I'm rubbing it into my hair to give my hair some definition just so that my hair could look just as how the clip-ins look. So the clip-ins that I'll be using for the back section, that's what it looks like. It has two clips and it's the wider version. And I'm basically just spraying it with water just as how I sprayed my hair with water and use the same products. I'm doing the same thing to the clip-ins and then I'm going to clip it onto my hair. Right here I'm just detangling it so that the curls can kind of separate a bit more. And then I'm going ahead with the gel and giving the um, clip-ins some definition. So the first thing you do is open the clips, obviously. <laughs> so yeah, you open the clips and then you put it where you sectioned your hair off. You stick the clips in like the little comb part, you stick it in and then you close it so that it's secure. Now just to make sure that my hair blends in well with the clip-ins, I sprayed it with water and now I'm just like kind of detangling my hair with the clip-ins in it so that it blends better. I'm working on the second section now. I'm adding my products, the same products, the leave-in conditioner and the gel so that my hair can have the same curl pattern as the clip-ins which is 3C4A. Once again, opening the clips and getting ready to put it into my hair 
is very simple you just have to know which size fits your head best but you can test them out like place it over your head first to make sure that that's the size that fits that section and then you go ahead and you style So for this section, I decided to put two clip-ins in the same place because I wanted to have more volume and I wanted it to look more natural. So I put two clip-ins for that section. So I'll basically just be doing the same thing over and over, applying the products and put in the clips over that you guys get the gist of it you guys get the memo so i'm just gonna shut up now <laughs> So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably already saw this clip already. So I was just detangling my hair with the Denman brush and I was in love with how it was bouncing back. So I was like, let me post this. Like, it's just so cute. <laughs> but yeah, I'm basically going to be doing the same thing over and over again. Um, For this section, I put the two clips for the top because I wanted to double it. As you guys can see, I put the other two clip right next to it. And then I'm going to put another clip-in over those two clip-ins just because I wanted more volume. So we're down to the last section. This will be my leave out section and I'm giving it like the most definition. I was like, let me scrunch it and everything, get those curls popping because that's the parts that's going to be showing the most, you know, that's the leave out. So yeah, that's what you guys are seeing me do right now. So now that I'm done with the back section, I moved along and I started with the front section. I was so excited to do my two little buns because OMG, like I had this look in my head. I was like, yes, girl, you're going to be popping. So I was like so excited to finish this look. Um, I'm starting off by spraying my hair with water so that I can detangle my hair to put it up into a ponytail and wrap it into a bun. And yeah, that's what you guys are going to be seeing me do. So just to make my hair look a bit more natural, I took a piece from the front out and also from the sides just to give it a little pop. So now for like the easiest part, you just wrap your hair around literally and then you wrap it into a little bun and you secure it with whatever you want to secure it with. I use a little tie and that's it. So now for the hardest part, I'm using um, the widest clip-ins. They have five clips in it and I'm going to be clipping it around the base of my hair 
you're literally just pushing the comb into the base of where the bun is you're securing the clips like closing it and you just keep going around the base of that bun until all the clippings are clipped in So it took forever to clip the clips in and I didn't want to make this video too long so I fast forwarded it and now I'm just showing you guys how I wrap the hair around my little bun and then I secure the hair. I was making it really messy to give it that natural look because it looks way better when it has the natural look. So I'm using the gel and the leave-in conditioner to give my hair definition, the parts that I left out. Yeah, I gave those some definition just so that the curls could pop. Now once again, I'm putting my hair up into the ponytail. I'm adding my gel and smoothing out my hair just so that the ponytail can be really nice and smooth. So I'm literally doing the same thing that I did to the other side, to this side, wrapping my hair into a bun, securing the bun, and putting the clippings over that bun. So a little hair was sticking out from the side and so I pulled it out and I just wrapped it around my hair. Um, I was basically done with my buns but if you want to make your buns a bit bigger than mine, you can fluff them out. But I was satisfied with how my buns were so I left it just like that. And then I went ahead and I started with the back section of my hair. My hair got a bit frizzy. I don't know why that section of my hair always gets frizzy so easily. So I sprayed it with water and I applied more products because applying more products will help your hair to like be more defined and stay defined for a longer time. So I added more gel to certain sections of my hair that were frizzing up. And then yeah, that's all I did and I did it to the other side too and the style was basically done. So now for my edges, I'm using a regular toothbrush and the same eco style gel and I'm just swooping like swoop. <laughs> Lol, shout out to um Samarello. I got that from her, you know, the little swoop thing. But yeah. So your girl was basically just feeling herself. I was like, yes, honey, you're popping. Work it, girl. <laughs> but yeah, I felt so beautiful with this hairstyle. I don't think I've ever done any hairstyles that was like this beautiful so this is hands down my favorite hairstyle that i've ever done it was just really nice so thanks to better length hair for sending me these clippings because they made me look so good and i really loved it so i'm just gonna show you guys some pictures